vanishes, actually. Oh. Um, lots of vanishes, uh, especially off the ledge. Tries to get that little uh, cute vanish back to the ledge thing. Like oh, yeah. We have a uh, Void does that a lot, too. He mm -hmm. is the uh, resident Sheik player here. Yes, he is. Sure, um, you know about Roy, uh, Void. We do know about Void. Void is, uh, uh, of course, a huge threat. Um, yes, uh, he is. We're all going to be watching out for him tomorrow. Um, I believe he's teaming with Zero, actually, in doubles. I believe so. And right now, we are getting right into the game. Hitaku versus Psyche. Um, Very curious to see how this is going to go. Yeah, and you saw a little bit of uh, lead there from uh, Psyche, but Mewtwo's damage output just is absolutely oh, yeah. insane. Yeah, his, his forward air and his shadow ball do some ridiculous amounts of damage. Every single one of his moves is just absolutely huge. Yeah, damage. that's um, true. That's even, true. even Confusion. People think Confusion is kind of a bad move, but it locks you on platform. You can't get out if you want to shield, and then all of a sudden you take 9%. Yep. And if you're not you careful, you smashed. may take a forward air afterwards. Yeah, forward air or an up smash or pretty much anything, really. And that was a really smart bouncing fish. Uh, I mean, most chicks can pretty much just throw it out, but that was... Very well placed, tacking on the extra percent. Back throw? Not quite enough, okay. Yeah, not at that percent. I was looking for the dare. Okay, no I thought he was looking for the two frame dare. I was about to go out. Messed up his shadow ball right there. Just done already. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. No. Wait, I thought that was going to kill, and I was going to. That was. That would have been cool. Oh, he looked for the needle, needle fist right there, but wasn't quite able to get it. Um, I think only because he got only one needle instead of the full charge. Got the air dodge reading there's up there. Oh, wow. Not quite enough, but a Shadow Ball would have done it. An up throw will definitely kill. Absolutely. Um, just enough rage to push out. Yeah, and this is Town and City, so the, the borders are a lot smaller here. Psyche looking real brave, just standing right outside that man's grab range. Not respecting me too, the area moves are quite enough. Oh my god, what a deep bouncing fish. Beautiful <laughs> stuff by Psyche. I wasn't even respecting that. I wasn't even expecting that. No, no Psyche's not known for being a very aggressive player, but that was an incredibly aggressive move. Yeah, that was really nice stuff. And now we are here in the second stock. This is the both players' last stock for this game. And I'd like to see how Psyche can bring this fight back. Yeah, um, obviously Mewtwo, uh, okay, so we have, um, we have a couple of Mewtwo players out in uh, AC. Wow. Um, but Mewtwo's definitely a matchup not a lot of players are going to win because he is very recently good. Yeah, exactly. Well, he, he's, yeah, pretty much. They patched, oh, no. He's good. He's got his gun. He's fine. Yeah. That was a very nice drag down by... <sighs> got an air dodge read again. Uh, Saki's got to watch out for that. Yeah, this is... Hitaku is just teaching him that you just can't air dodge against him. Yep, sure. Um... Mewtwo can really punish the air dodge real hard. Oh, wow. That's so not so quite gonna... Oh, yeah, it well. did! Wow, yeah. A little bit, little bit of rage, Town and City, and Sheik being like the third largest character, fifth largest, something like that, largest character in the game. It's pretty far down there, for sure. It's very far down there. Yeah. It's like definitely top seven lightest characters. She's around seven-ish, yeah. I know, yeah, it's somewhere in there. So, that's everything in the kill. So, Hitako, good job taking game one. Well, we see, we've seen so many. I think the last five sets we've seen have been game three. Yeah. So awesome. I, I'd like to see this to go to game three because i like to see what Psyche could do. Hey, I mean, I'm a Mewtwo player. I want to pick up some tips from this guy. Yeah, Mewtwo is such a cool character. This he character is, is just fun. Um, and I think he deals really well with Sheik, actually. Um, I think so, too. Even, even before Sheik got nerfed, uh, Mewtwo was actually known for being, dealing really well with Sheik just because he could actually air dodge out of the 50-50. Because the air dodge is that good. Um, that is very true. Is it a frame two or is it a frame three? Frame two, I'm very sure. Um, uh, very known for being excellent air dodge, of course. Um, also, not only is it very fast, it has very low ending lag. That was a, that <laughs> was a killer <laughs> read, but you were just a little bit too late. Sorry, anyway, what were you saying? Um, about Mewtwo's air dodge, it's not just uh, fast and low ending lag, but it's also, uh, he's invisible while he's still vulnerable. That is true. He has one of the best, arguably the best air dodge in the game because of your mix-up game. As long as you're, like, when you two, when the both players are close to each other, it doesn't show the, the, the tags above their names. So if you jump back and air dodge when you're close enough, oh my god, he's, yeah, he's it's, it's hard to know where he's going to end up, and y you see a lot of uh, Mewtwo players short hop air dodge into fair. And it's like one of the best ways to just rack up damage, because you don't know where he's going to come out of. Like right now, you see right there, you can't see his tag, so you don't know where he's going. Yeah, that's true. And Mewtwo is one of those characters that can actually move while air dodging. Yeah, he has um, amazing aerial, aerial mo uh, mobility. Similar to uh, like Luigi's. Yes. I think even better than Luigi's. Oh, the finish. Yeah. Well, Psyche making it back though. Looking for the bouncing fish, but uh, Nikaru air dodging this time. 
Yeah, he's Taku, not good. Good air dodge. Oh, look for that air dodge, neutral air. Very good option out of a uh, out of neutral. Uh, sorry, out of air dodge. Very very smart. Uh, high recovery. That was really really genius. And get the air off stage. Yeah. That's gonna do it. All right. Yeah, strong hit there. A little bit of a lead now. Psyche is actually looking like he wants to take this game, and we will see a game three. But will Hitaku have the response? Got a nice little string here. Get quite a bit of percent off it, and making an excellent stage control. Yeah, 40%, 53%, and counting. This man has yet to get back onto stage, and just keeps racking up damage. Yeah. Uh, Psyche's stage control is just amazing right now. Yeah, he he's getting, has not given it up. No, he has not. And we're finally back to a neutral game. But um, then once again, Psyche lifts. later. Yeah. Just like that, Psyche has brought this game to so far in his advantage, he has almost an entire stock lead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you can definitely tell. Ooh. I thought that was good. Good, good air dodge read. That's not good. Wow, that, that killed. Yeah. All right. <laughs> you mentioned light characters. Me too. Is, I, I believe yeah. the third lightest character. Yeah, he is. Here. He is definitely um, incredibly. Light. I'm pretty sure the only ones lighter are Jigglypuff and Game and Game Watch. Watch. Yeah. Um, so yeah, he dies really early. And not only that, he's got a gigantic body. Yeah, it's really easy to hit him. Um, so, <laughs> very floaty, obviously. Excellent way to get out of things. And, you know, just jump away and air dodge a lot, but, uh... But he's still very light yeah. regardless, and he will take those, uh, early L's if you, uh, if you hand them to him. So that's actually a two-stock for second. That yeah, that was a very solid two-stock. That second stock, I think he only took, like, 3% damage. Yeah, um, super impressed with Psyche for maybe not totally adjusting the matchup, um, but... Final obviously is going to be able to camp a little bit better. Uh, get a little bit extra percent off those fair strings. Oh wow, that's oh, wrong way, that's a fist. <laughs> wrong way, Sheik. But that's okay. He's still going to get him locked into another forward uh, tilt combo. Not a whole lot of damage. But I feel like Sheik is one of the characters where, even though she doesn't do a lot of damage, she definitely gets inside of your head with all of these combos. This is true. Really good down tilt fair string. Uh, Ooh. Just okay. like that. Just like that right now, this is a fairly yeah. even game. Oh, wow. He's got his jump. He's back on stage. Good stuff from Hitaku. He's done a lot of uh, effort trying to get them there to drag down. Um, and I mean, he's got the oh air Oh, my. Not that, wow. He did kill, even on Battlefield. That was amazing. Hitaku with the beautiful up smash read, like fully charged, too. Yeah. Almost. That was, that was so much. Wow. Um, but Saiki's gonna have to play real hard to get back into this one. Uh, Mewtwo is not near kill percent yet, except for an X-Man. Yeah, and not yeah, not only is he in kill, like he's Sheik is has such a problem killing. The only good thing is that Mewtwo is a very light character. We have seen it. Uh, we have seen him kill very pretty early with an up, with an up air. That's gonna the kill. The needlefish got yep. it. Okay, and Psyche's right back in it. Yeah. 15 percent deficit. That's nothing. Yeah, that is a really good. If you want to be in deficit at all, 50 percent not bad against not Sheik. Not at all. Oh, he's talking definitely using the air dodge. He's trying to get in. Oh, that's not smart. Um, he's trying to go for confusion, but actually, guaranteed, so I could get a forward air after it. Yep. Oh, beautiful. Wow, that, what a combo. That was a really smart string. He unfortunately missed that fo uh, forward air to finish the combo off, but it was still. <gasps> got another air dodge read. It's like he's got to watch out for those. Yeah. But look at this. I oh, I thought he was going to go for the bouncing fish. Not quite. I'm too used to seeing K9 play. K9 is really aggressive. He is. Um, K9 definitely uh, going to throw out the bouncy fish either right away or after he does. Yeah, and Psyche is not throwing out as yeah. many bouncy fish, but he's doing a really good job with his nair pressure. Yeah, just keeping him off stage. And this is now, Hitaku now has the, I'm sorry, Psyche, Psyche, Psyche now has the advantage. <gasps> oh no! He got back. Oh yes, and he did. Hitaku okay. Well. Magnet hands. That's the forward air. Psyche with a huge lead right now, but. Uh, Strong up smash could still point it for Hitaku. Yeah, he was about at the... Oh, no! Is that, is that it? it? He yes, is Hitaku! Oh, my goodness. This man! Once again... You were talking about this earlier. You get confusion under the platform, and then you get... You re, you, you yeah, eat just that. an easy tech chase right there. Yeah. Um, and he just walked up slowly and just got smash. a guaranteed up smash. I mean, there's only... I mean, really, if you if he wanted to, he could have just ran back, <laughs> ran forth, and uh, up smash recovered the entire platform if he wants to. But Smoochie's up smash has such a big range that he can just... Sit on one side if you're, you're going to roll this side.